From affordable on any budget to what were they thinking, these campers are all a sight to behold. This is Reacher and here are 10 camper vans, caravans, and motorhomes that'll make you want to sell your house. Number 10. This handy little caravan from Winnebago is perfect for starting up this list. And though it may look smaller than most, it's got just about everything you'd need for a camping trip and more than enough room to put it in. When you consider that it has eight different floor plans, you may begin to question if the company might have been overdoing it. But each one is set up in a very intuitive way that maximizes every bit of the available space. So Winnebago, if you're listening, give those people a raise. It's built on a framework measuring anywhere from just under 27 feet to just under 29 feet in length, depending on which of the aforementioned floor plans are chosen. Each has a height of 10 to 10 and a half feet and a width of 8 feet. And for the taller people out there, the interior height is 6 and a half feet, so you're probably good to go. Each one comes standard with a lounge area that contains a dinette table and a seating arrangement consisting of either a couch, a U-shaped bench, standard bench seating, or a mix of the different styles. This may already sound like a tight fit, but the seating is housed in the power slide out, which provides extra floor space when extended. The kitchen area consists of a double door refrigerator freezer, a microwave, a double bowl sink, and a triple burner cooktop with an oven. Some of the floor plans include an additional dual burner cooktop, sink, and refrigerator that can be accessed externally. All but one of the floor plans has the sleeping area at the front of the trailer. All of the bedroom areas have a walk-around queen bed, a nightstand, and a wardrobe. Additionally, some also have an extra door that opens from the bedroom to the outside. The bathrooms are spacious as well, consisting of a toilet with a foot pedal flushing system, a sink with a large countertop and vanity mirror above, and a fully enclosed stand-up shower. Other features include an audio video system with external speakers, a 26-inch LED TV in the lounge area, USB charging ports, an electric awning with LED lighting, and full linoleum throughout for easier cleaning. Pricing on this one starts at $30,600. Number 9. Although its color scheme may give you the impression of a basic design, this is every bit of what a contemporary caravan should be. The box shape, with its rounded ends and slightly arched roof, measures 30 feet in length and 8 feet in width, with an internal height of just over 7.5 feet. In the rear is a lounge area with bench seating that forms an almost complete circle around an adjustable dining table. Backed up to that is a kitchen area with an L-shaped countertop that offers a generous amount of working space as well as a three-burner cooktop and large stainless steel sink. Next to that is a 150-liter slimline refrigerator with a removable 15-liter freezer. Next to that moving forward is a split bathroom with the washroom and toilet on one side of the bedroom door and the shower on the other. The washroom has a rotating cassette toilet and a large corner sink with plenty of counter space and mirrors on each side. The shower area has more than enough space at almost 9 square feet. Travelers have their choice of a queen size bed or two double beds. Pricing on this one is currently around $39,000. Number eight. If you ask for liner style quality in a low profile motorhome, this is the company you'd ask, and this is the vehicle you'd expect. It comes in two models offering differences in the sleeping and seating accommodations with lengths of just under 23 feet and just over 24 and a half feet. The slim design does a good job of hiding the almost seven and a half feet width. The bedroom area is housed in the rear with the choice of either a queen bed or two twin beds. Multiple storage areas are available for use both under the beds and in the floor. There's also a sunroof and two side windows that allow natural light and airflow. Moving forward, there's a uniquely styled bathroom that has a cassette toilet and wash basin with a mirror that both rotate into compartments in the wall, allowing for a larger shower space that includes a bench area. The kitchen is concealed in what appears to be a regular cabinet, but when the flip top lids are opened, it reveals a dual burner cooktop and sink. Opposite that, on the other side of the vehicle, is a slimline 14-liter refrigerator with a freezer and bottle drawer. The lounge area has two choices of seating, either in a double bench style with a removable table or a single bench and extra captain's chair with an extendable bar area. This seating can be modified to create an extra twin bed if needed. The base price for this one currently starts at $77,000. 
be sure and hit the subscribe button and click that bell icon to stay up to date on all our latest videos. Number 7 This low profile coach with its distinctive curvy rear panel has exactly what you'd need, assuming you like the features of a higher end, more luxurious motorhome. It's mounted on the camper version of Fiat's chassis, giving it a length of 23 feet and a width of just over 7.5 feet. The powertrain consists of a 2.3 liter multi-jet turbo diesel producing 130 horsepower to a 6-speed manual transmission. The lounge area can accommodate up to 6 people using the swiveling cab seats. The kitchen area has a slimline 150 liter refrigerator with a removable 15 liter freezer unit. Across from that is an L-shaped counter area that contains a sink with a cutting board cover and a three burner stovetop. The bathroom area takes the same approach with the toilet and sink directly across from the shower. The washroom has an L-shaped counter with a sink, mirrored cabinets, and a cassette toilet that rotates to maximize the usable space. A sliding door allows access to this area from either the front or the rear which lets anyone using it do so without disturbing anyone in the other areas. The shower area has sliding doors to fully enclose the user with a space for standing as well as a bench for sitting if needed. The bathing facilities flank a wooden sliding door that offers privacy to the bedroom area which can sleep two people comfortably in the double bed. A drop down bed in the lounge area which doubles as the ceiling offers sleeping space for two more people. There are plenty of other features that come standard in the Optima Premium which are normally only found in larger more expensive motorhomes. If you're interested in getting one, the starting price is around $80,000. Number 6 This camper van has the design features and functionality needed for longer trips with the feel of a van geared more towards recreational outings. It's based around a Ram Promaster 2500 van with a 3.6 liter V6 engine providing 280 horsepower to a 6-speed automatic transmission. The chassis has a length of 19.5 feet, a width of just under 7 feet, and a height of 9.5 feet. Bench seating and the rotating captain's chairs in the cab can accommodate up to four people at the fold-up dining table in the lounge area. The kitchenette has a sink, a dual burner cooktop, a microwave oven, and an 88-liter mini-fridge. The fully enclosed wet bath has a swiveling cassette toilet, a fold-down sink, and a shower head which doubles as the sink's faucet. There's also a large wall mirror as well as a vanity mirror above the sink. The sleeping area is located in the rear of the van. A fold-down platform has a foldable queen-size mattress which can sleep two people. The sleeping capacity can be doubled by converting the lounge seating into a double bed. There's also two larger models built on the Ram Promaster 3500 van, the Active 2.0 and the Active 2.0 Loft Edition. Both offer more generous accommodations with the loft edition having a pop-up that creates an extra sleeping area about the size of a double bed. The starting price on this one runs about $93,000. Number 7 Don't let the design of this one mislead you with its single side windows on a plain white exterior. Although it looks simple, it's what you can't see that counts. The fiberglass monocoque body measures just over 7 feet wide, 17 and a half feet long, and 9 feet high with a dry weight of just over 5,700 pounds. It sits on a Volkswagen T6 base with a powertrain consisting of a 2 liter 150 horsepower turbo diesel engine with an automatic transmission. The unique placement of the entrance door at the rear of the right side creates a more intuitive use of the living space. This, along with the two large windows and sunroof, give it the feeling of a much larger area. The kitchenette includes a dual burner cooktop, a mini fridge, and a sink with a chopping block cover. Opposite that is a dinette area with a removable table and a choice of either bench style seating or a single L-shaped bench. There's also a wet bath which includes a swiveling toilet, a handheld shower head, and a sink with shelves and a vanity mirror above. The bottom of a drop down bed doubles as the ceiling and when lowered can sleep two people comfortably with a capacity up to 770 pounds. If needed, the dinette seating can be converted to another bed to double the sleeping capacity. Pricing on this one will currently run you about $102,000. Number 8 No list of this kind would be complete without at least one vehicle from Winnebago. This entry into the Class C market offers two floor plans measuring 29.5 feet and 32.5 feet in length with a width of just under 8 feet. 
It sits on a Ford E450 chassis with a 6.8 liter V10 producing 305 horsepower with a six-speed automatic transmission rounding out the powertrain. The larger of the two has three slide-out areas, whereas the smaller one only has two. The lounge areas can seat up to seven people using the swivel captain's chairs and bench seating. The galley area has a three-burner cooktop, a microwave, a slimline refrigerator, and a stainless steel double bowl sink. There's also a sink cover that sits flush with the countertop and an extension adding more space if needed. The bathroom in the larger unit is a split style with the washroom and the shower area separate from each other. The washroom has a porcelain toilet, a sink, and a vanity mirror. The shower sits opposite with a retractable sliding door and a removable shower head. Both models have a walk-around queen-size bed in the rear with nightstands as well as extra sleeping accommodations which can be made by modifying the lounge seating. The starting price on this one is $140,000. Number 3. There's a mix of things that make an all-terrain motorhome worth having. The ability for long-range travel, the right amount of luxury that says home, and a chassis that can handle it all. Sunlighter's Habitat HA3 is all of that and more. It sits atop a Ford Ranger 4x4 XL chassis that's been modified to handle the extra weight and higher center of gravity. The overcabin design measures 19 feet in length and just over 7 feet in width with a height of 9.5 feet. The powertrain is a 3.2 liter 5 cylinder turbo diesel coupled with a 6 speed automatic transmission producing 145 horsepower. The living area consists of horseshoe shaped bench seating with a collapsible table in the rear. The kitchenette includes a 90 liter single door fridge freezer, a microwave, a dual element ceramic cooktop, and a sink with a water purification system. Opening the door to the wet bath shows a 20 liter cassette toilet, a vanity mirror, a sink, and a handheld shower head. There's room to sleep up to four people with the cab over bed and the rear bench seating which converts to an extra bed. Other features include an external shower, a 22 inch LCD TV, a Bluetooth stereo system with internal and external speakers, external cameras and security lighting, a wind out awning, and a dual power supply consisting of a 150 watt solar panel and a 150 amp hour battery. All this can be yours for just over $141,000. Number two. If you live in a nothing but the best will do world, then this RV from Airstream is probably one you want to consider. The iconic brand is well known for its high-end craftsmanship and it shows with the inclusion of over 50 best-in-class features. The company collaborated with Mercedes-Benz on this one, not only for their safety and technology, but also for the powertrain, which employs a 3-liter V6 turbo diesel engine. The interior houses a living area with a slide out that allows the use of a 73 inch Murphy bed which folds into the wall when not in use. A 40 inch smart TV with a sound bar can raise out of or lower into a countertop hideaway at the touch of a button. There are also two pedestal tables which can be locked into the floor if needed. The kitchenette includes a full size aluminum refrigerator, pull out shelving, a microwave, a dual burner stovetop, a sink, and a drop in wastebasket. The bathroom includes a sink toilet, and a fully enclosed stand-up shower. Luxury is definitely the word on this one with a starting price of $221,000. Before we shock you with our awesome number one, don't forget to leave a comment letting us know which one of these you'd like to see parked in your driveway. Number one. One of the biggest concerns when buying a motorhome is space, hence the addition of slide outs. This was obviously on Protec's collective minds when they designed the Q18 because someone got the bright idea to make the whole of each side a slide out. Literally, front to back, top to bottom. The vehicle measures in at 26 feet in length and just over 7.5 feet in width which increases to 11.5 feet when expanded. Upon entering there is a dinette area with horseshoe shaped seating and a removable table. The kitchen includes a stainless steel sink, a three burner cooktop, a full size 160 liter refrigerator with a freezer, and an extra pull out worktop to supplement the counter space. Staying clean isn't a problem as the Q18 comes with a vanity area which connects to a separate enclosed shower area. The base price on this one starts at $254,000. Hey guys, this is Cassie. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell us in the comments below what you found to be the most interesting and why. Also, if you haven't done so yet, make sure to hit the bell notification next to the subscribe button to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.